internet and other online fraud are major challenges to the sustenance of global cashless transactions. Financial system experts and stakeholders are therefore advocating for a holistic approach to tackling the menace so as to ensure hitch free takeoff of the policy when it goes nationwide. Details in this report. With Nigeria's internet penetration estimated at 11 million and active mobile phone lines exceeding 127 million, as well as a literacy rate of 67%, analysts say Nigeria is on track to achieving its aspirations of becoming a cashless society. So we must make sure that we let it grow ethically and professionally. All the rural people can utilize these mobile banking facilities for which we, all, we are also taking preparation, hopefully within the next half of the years. However, the rising cases of global internet fraud have continued to attract counter-fraud measures being taken by authorities across the world. This group of experts say Nigerian banking regulators must also liaise with other stakeholders to come up with an up-to-date approach to counter internet and online fraud as the country takes steps to launch the national cashless policy. I'm glad that the bankers themselves have taken ownership of this by forming a very strong e-payment fraud committee. And I think all the stakeholders should support them in it. We will discomfort ourselves a little bit by moving a bit away from cash and by embracing technology and card. At the steep end of the learning curve, there may be a few challenges that we have to surmount. Biometric and the system will transform into developing or deepening banking system and you know, ensuring the ability of banks on the financial services provider towards serving their customers well and doing it without any fear that uh, when they need information that they will not, they will not be able to know who they are dealing with.